And a pretty ordinary ball here too from Gemma Barsby. Really dragged it down, but a magnificent catch by Darcy Brown. And down comes Paparo. They could lose a second. Well, that's not going to matter anymore. Don't worry about Megan Shoot. Gemma Barsby has got Chloe Paparo. Off the edge, it could have been a third wicket. Well, that's well struck from Maddie Green. Straight as a die, one bounce for four. And Devine up and over the top of mid-wicket. Not well timed, but it's away to the boundary. That's the power that Sophie Devine... And Devine going again. That is better. She's moving into her work nicely. And Devine, this is huge towards the leg side. It doesn't quite get there for six. Short, green on the pull. Beautifully timed. Well, has she got the golden arm today? Sophie Devine took a liking to that first ball and dispatches it for four. And Devine just sweeping, swatting it away with disdain. There's another slower ball, got on the full. That's the power, straight between two fielders. And Sophie Devine this time. Bridget Patterson in the deep with another huge catch. First ball, out. Caps out for a golden duck as well. And Deandra Dotton with a sharp catch at point. It's, um, it's awesome. We, we love getting in this kit and, um, you know, doing the massive barefoot circle this morning. Um, it's, it's a really nice feel um, around the group to come down and do it. Out. Off the edge. Oh, the cries will be there. Get a slip in. It's a boundary for Carmichael. Well, this is underneath, and that is not what the Scorchers needed. Megan shoot with 100 wickets now. We see Matilda Carmichael seems to be quite clear on her plan. So the last ball of Barsby spell, does it bring another wicket? Yes, it does. That's outstanding fielding from Bridget Patterson. And now Edgar, is it going to be two in two again? Yes. They're on a team hat trick this time, the Adelaide Strikers. This is one of the most bizarre matches you will see. Well, here's King, lofting it deep. Catches are in the game. The catching has been superb from the strikers today. Oh, nice little scoop up and over the top, down towards fine leg for four. And off the edge. And taken by Tegan McFarlane. So Piper Cleary, it was a handy 12. But Deandra Dotton breaks through for her first wicket of the day. And off the edge. And taken by Tegan McFarlane. So Piper Cleary, it was a handy 12. But Deandra Dotton breaks through for her first wicket of the day. And that is the end of the innings. So just confirmation, the final score for the Scorchers, 9 for 119 at the end of the 20 overs. And slow bowling first up with Lily Mills. 11 wickets this season, 6.3 economy rate. It's like you've got to recalibrate, and I tell you what, Dotton is calibrating her shots beautifully today. Another one over the offside for four. And Katie Mack back in the crease has powered that into the gap in front of Alana King. And Katie Mack getting under this and giving her wicket away. So finally, the Perth Scorchers get the wicket, the safe pair of hands. And Vulvart, this is a leading edge, and there's the second. Will her struggles continue? And Perth have two wickets in quick succession.
crunches it through. Much needed boundary for the Adelaide Strikers. And down comes Dotton. One boundary is not enough. She's got two in two. And now they're accelerating right before the drinks break. She's coming down again. Three boundaries in the over for Deandra Dotton. And poor Fatalia, but um, girl's got a rest and at least she's doing it. And speaking of that shooter, obviously, that also creates an opportunity for you, Skipper, for the Scorps. What do you love about being a captain? Well, there's the intention. Slaps it over the top for a maximum. Well, Dot looking for a half century, and she's got one with that boundary. Second of the season, and she is pushing the strikers towards victory here. And just whipping it around the corner. Chases on for Edgar. She won't get there. And this power surge is proving costly. But somehow Bridget Patterson has avoided being bowled. And it's going to be four. And this is going to go against Beth Mooney, the dreaded four buys. Well, that's a full toss down the leg side. Deandra Dotton says, thank you very much. And now, unloading and out. Alana King on the boundary. Unfortunately, though, for the Perth Scorchers. And down comes Patterson. Straight down the ground. They're almost there, the Adelaide Strikers. Just two to win after that glorious straight drive. Oh, almost a wicket for Alana King, but it's Maddie Penner who finishes off the victory for the Adelaide Strikers. Back-to-back -back wins against the champions, the Perth Scorchers, since that final defeat last year. And they are up to second on the table.